Hello, I'm Glenn Main, and in this video I'm gonna show you how I rebuilt this good old MC50 sequencer from Roland with a floppy drive and changed it into a USB drive. Along with the USB floppy disk emulator you get the CD with disk utilities to make your USB stick be recognized as a floppy disk. There are two sizes of the screws on the MC50, so be sure to organize them well. When you have removed the back cover, you can easily see the old floppy drive right here. Now you can easily remove the four screws holding the bracket, and of course remember to take away the cables on the back. Now that the floppy disk is uh, out, I want to keep the brackets until later because I will use the same brackets for the new disk drive. A very important thing to check when you get this uh, disk is to check that the jumper switches are placed on the number 2 and number 7 to get it work with the MC50. The next step is really not a must but when you're into your machine then it's so easy to remove this print and take away the rubber on the back of the buttons and clean it up and give your machine a little spa treatment before you put it back together. This little cleaning session will maybe take you like 15 minutes but it's so worth it. Your MC50 will feel like brand new again. So now you have come to the point where you can put in your new USB drive into your MC50. And wow, that is a good feeling. So here it is, ready to go. Boom. So here it's a moment of truth. It might be a good idea to check this before you put it all back together again, but uh, seems like it's working. It's firing up and yes, it is working. So now it's time to try it with the USB stick in the drive and see if we can get the familiar sound, the so well-known clicks from the metronome. It's working perfectly. So now I have my good old MC50 working again. So in the next episode I will show you how I used to make my synth music with this one and the good old synthesizers. So, hope to see you then. Please subscribe to my channel to see more of my studio and my synth wave music made by real, authentic 80s, 90s stuff.